My name is Uwe Platzbecker. I'm from the Department of Hematology of the University Hospital in Dresden, Germany. And I'm going to present during this ASH meeting a prospective study we have done within the Study Alliance Leukemia, the SAL study group, where we prospectively measured minimal or if you want so measurable residual disease in AML patients. And in case of uh, rising MRD, so if you want so imminent relapse, imminent hematological relapse, we preemptively um, administered patients azacitidine in order to delay or prevent uh, hematological relapse. So the way we uh, performed the study within the SAL study group was to prospectively screen 205 uh, patients with MDS or AML undergoing conventional chemotherapy or allogenic stem cell transplantation. And what we did during the screening phase is we measured minimal residual disease by mutation level of nucleophosmin, which was actually um, uh, the major part of the patient population. And in patients after transplant, we took advantage of a so-called CD34 chimerism uh, in the peripheral blood, uh, which is also very sensitive and can detect MRD in these patients. So when the patients um, had or displayed a certain threshold or were beyond a certain threshold of MRD, they received preemptive treatment with azacitidine for up to two years. From these two, almost 205 patients, 53 developed MRD during the course of uh, um, the study. And um, the majority, 58%, did not relapse within the first six months of treatment. We also saw some relapses, late relapses in these, uh, in these patients, even upon continuation of azacitin treatment. But still, the data look very promising in a way that, especially after stem cell transplantation, relapse was delayed or completely prevented in roughly 40% of the patients. So this study could be the backbone uh, for future studies in the field of MRD-triggered treatment, which I think is already standard of care in ALL or in CML or APL, but I think AML is still uh, a, a moving target with regards to MRD, and I think we are quite uh, thrilled by the data and hope to share the data on Monday with the audience.